bringing the truck back to Grandma. Yep. I don't want to. She told me, you better not pull off. You better not pull off. And we did. No! After four years of having this bad boy, we got to bring yep. it back. No, I'm scared. But guess what? Tomorrow we're going to the beach. Why are you scared to bring it back? Because we've had it for so long? Yeah. I know. You only know why I'm scared of like bringing it back? Because I had this growing up. You grew up in this truck. Yeah. We got it's... it when she was four. She's eight now. And it's big. You just don't like the new car. It's small. It is. Yeah. This thing is like badass. I'm gonna cry too. I'm having separation anxiety. That's why I held on to the new truck. I held on to the truck while I had my new car for a whole week. I brought the car home and just sat it outside the house. I didn't even drive it. I love this too much. Like we're high up. It's, we've been through a lot with this truck, huh? That means we're gonna have to clear up this too. I did. LA. Man, Grandma's happy. She gets a truck back. Yeah, cause she doesn't have car labeling in her back. <coughs> yeah, well, we're gonna say our goodbyes to it, okay? Why are you crying? You can give the truck a hug. You want to give it a hug? Give it a hug. Look, I'm gonna miss you. Thank you for four years, truck. Thank you for four years. Don't do that. You got dirt on your neck. mascara on your neck. Can you believe this day has come, Larice, to return the truck back to its home? It'll be okay. I'm gonna miss this truck. Bye, Silverado. You've done your job. Thank you so much. I have separation anxiety too. It's gonna to be really weird not getting into this big ass thing every day and going from this big ass thing to my little bitty car.